Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is me, JV. So in this video, I'm going to share with you guys my experience dito sa ginawa kong one week vegan challenge. And just to give you a short story before ko kayo dalhin dun sa experience kong yon and i-share sa inyo kung ano yung mga kinain ko for the whole week. Um, just a little story kung bakit ko siya ginawa is that um, a week before ko siya gawin, um, me and my husband, Lee, decided to do or decided to eat healthy food like less meat, more veggies, like you know, like very healthy. And then back then, I'm weighing maybe 70 kilos. And then after doing that, like eating healthy food and doing exercise, I lost 5 kilos and I was so happy sa naging result. And then I decided why not to do this vegan challenge. So nabawasan nga ba ako ng timbang sa one week vegan challenge na to? Let's watch this. <laughs> so today for our breakfast, I'm going to make sweet corn chowder. I saw one video online sa YouTube. And yeah, I already have my recipe with me. And for the recipe, I'll just put the recipe on the description box below. So yeah guys, join me for the whole week and we'll see what will happen on me. <laughs> kung papit ba ako or ano mga yan kung mababawas ba ng timbang so yes okay guys so nakapag prep na ako and now we're going to start the soup so first let's blend garlic onion so dahil soup siya kailangan natin siyang i-food processor So now we're going to just a pot. So we're going to I'm going to blend sweet corn. So next let's add salt and pepper. So now we're going to put dried thyme and smoked paprika. And now we're going to put our Sweet corn. Now we're going to put our vegetable stock. So, vegan. Mm. So, ayan na siya. And dahil wala ako nakitang vegan cream, I'll just use this cream cheese, vegan cream cheese para mag-thicken at maging creamy pa siya. So, we're done with our soup and we'll just set aside this. So, ito pan fried lang natin tong corn para lang magkaroon tayo ng additional flavor dun sa soup natin kapag meron na siyang mga smoky smoky keme. Talagin natin siya dun mamaya. So, habang hinihintay natin yung corn dun na maluto, I-prepare ko muna itong bread na paglalagyan nung soup natin. Ito yung nakakamayaman effect dito sa recipe na ito. So yun, cut nyo lang siya and butasan nyo yung gitna. So don't worry about sa mga bread na tinatanggal nyo kasi pwede siyang gamitin breadcrumbs, pwede din siyang gamitin um, pampalapot, natural na pampalapot sa niluluto nyo. So yan, basically gagawa lang kayo ng bowl using this bread. So ayan siya. So lagyan na natin siya mamaya. Diba? Nakakasasyad. Tapos... Pwede mo na siyang hati-hatiin, tapos saw-saw, kain, gano'n. And now, linisin lang natin siya. So, pinilitan ko muna ng pan tong corn natin kasi parang hindi ko ma-achieve yung parang grilling color or sunog na color dun sa pan na yun. But this one is a proper grilling pan, kaya medyo ma-achieve natin yung mga sunog-sunog na ganyan. 
So this time I'm going to reheat this first sa oven. I'll just reheat it para magkaroon din siya ng mas toasted flavor or toasted basta para matusta siya sa lakas. <laughs> Yun. So ito try na natin yung sweet corn chowder. Ayan na siya. So, okay kung mag-reach siya. gamit ng bread. So, so nyo. And then. Manom. Sarap. So, tawagin ko lang siya ulit. Balik ako. Kasi baka lumamin. Is it good? It is very healthy. <coughs> So this is my day two of my one week vegan challenge. And last night, nag dinner lang ako ng tofu with some um, pet chai, then pak choy. So yun lang kinain ko. And then today, my breakfast is this cream cheese with plant based smoked ham. So yeah, it's actually really good. So yun hindi na ako nag uh, nag-feel kung paano ko siya niluto basta madali lang siya and siguro ilalagay ko na lang lahat ng mga kinain ko or instruction ng mga niluto ko on the description box down may umiiyak na bata sa kapitbahay Day 3 of my one week vegan challenge and today I'm going to cook something na pwede nyo lutuin din at home na super vegan talaga siya and sobrang dali lang niyang gawin. This is a pasta recipe. So just an update. Kahapon, nagluto lang ako ng Asian garlic plant-based chicken with cauliflower rice. Sobrang easy lang din nung recipe na yun. I will just put the recipe on the description box. Hindi na ako nag-film kung paano ko siya niluto, but madali lang siya, promise. Hi guys! So today, it's day 4 of my one week vegan challenge. And now it's dinner time. So kinain lang namin kayo ng lunch is, or kinain ko kanin ng lunch is yung arabiata pasta na ginawa ko kahapon. And ngayon, since it's dinner time, I'm going to make pizza, vegan pizza, and non-vegan pizza for Lee. So yeah, see you guys after ko magawa ito. Okay? Join us sa dinner na. So, ito na yung pizza namin before ko siya lagay sa oven. So, I used the arabiata sauce for our pizza. And this is mine. And this is Lee. And <laughs> wala siyang meat dahil nakalimutan kong wala na pala kaming bacon. So, this one on my vegan pizza, I use plant-based mocham dito sa toppings. And also this um, vegan cheese. So, Let's put it in the oven. So the pizza is done. This is his pizza. I just add goat cheese on top of his pizza. And this is my pizza. So yeah, it's dinner time. See you guys tomorrow. Bye. Hi, so today it's Friday, day five of Vegan Week Challenge. And tonight I made some Pumpkin risotto. This is the pumpkin risotto. There you go. And getting ng lunch, I only had the um, pumpkin ravioli and I used the arabiata sauce. So that's all my lunch. And yeah, see you tomorrow. So there you go, guys. That's my experience. And yan yung mga kinain ko for the whole week by doing this um, one week vegan challenge. And hindi na ako nakapag-film ng Saturday and Sunday but I'll just put somewhere here kung ano yung kinain ko ng Saturday and Sunday. But basically, halos pare-pareho din naman na yung kinain ko after ko maluto yung arabiata sauce. Pasta lang ako ng pasta and 
ginamit ko lang yung sauce na yun sa iba't ibang mga niluto ko. Iba't ibang pasa din yung ginamit ko. So, yun. I'll just uh, see you on my next video dun sa pagluluto ko ng arabiaka sauce, which is after this video. Gagawa ko ng next video para sa recipe ng arabiaka sauce. Sana panoorin nyo. Um, siguro ang take ko lang by doing this challenge is that um, vegan ka man or hindi, nasa iyo kung anong gusto mong kainin. And kung gusto mong gawas ng timbang, kailangan talaga is yung disiplina talaga. Siguro kaya hindi rin ako nabawasan ng timbang dahil 65 pa rin ako ngayon. But namintin ko yung kilo kong yun or yung timbang kong yun for the whole week. Dahil um, yun, sinasabihan ko ng exercise. Siguro by next time, kung gusto ko parang talaga mas mabawasan yung timbang ko is kailangan maging strict ako dun sa kakainin ko. And yun, nakakatawa. Uh, ang saya kapag nakakita ka ng progress sa sarili mo, yung nababawasan ka ng timbang, nag-shed ka, tapos parang nagkakashape yung katawan mo. Nakakatawa, siguro mas gagawin ko pa or kailangan hindi ako tama rin na mag-exercise. So, yun. Um, sana na-enjoy nyo at may natutunan kayong aral. <laughs> May inspire kayo dito sa video na to. But yeah, um, keep exercising and stay safe everyone. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe. And if you have something na gusto nyo gawin ko on my next video or in on my next video, just put your comment down below and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye! Arabiata sauce pasta next video na! Bye!